Now that we have added array groups and speakers to our project, we can start adding advanced groups to give us even more control of our system. In order to do that, we go under Design, Add, and then we click the Advanced Group tool at the top bar. Just like for array groups, we can see that an empty group box has been added to the workspace. We can click on Assign, which turns into Assigning, with a green background, and we can start adding individual loudspeakers to this group just by clicking on them. We have to click on Assigning to close the selection, and even though these loudspeakers are not displayed under the group, they have been assigned to it. This is a visual aid that will help us to move the group around without having to move the loudspeakers as well. We can then click at the top of this group and give it a name. Let's call this one Main. We can then add a second advanced group by clicking Advanced Group again. And this time, after we click Assign, we will select all loudspeakers we have in our project at the same time. And they will all be added to this new group. We then click on Assigning again to close the selection and give it another name. Let's call this one All PA. And this is how we can add advanced groups to a project for a better management of groups of loudspeakers. If you have any questions about this or any other videos in the series, please feel free to contact us on support.audio at powersoft.com.